from this package that we bought from uh, Yamaha itself. Uh, we felt that uh, there's not an awful lot of storage space on the Yamaha Tricity 300, so we decided to buy the uh, console bag. So, anyway, here it is. I'm just going to take it out of the box. All the packaging in it. With it comes the basic instruction uh, paper. And here we have the console bag. So, here we have it. It's got two pockets inside. There's one here. And there's one on the other side. You have the Yamaha logo on the front. Feels a bit like a, a leatherette feel on the side, on the bottom. It's actually a bit thicker and tougher on the bottom, I guess that's so it, it fits well on the uh, scooter. Stops it from sliding. But you have the handle and you have your shoulder strap to carry it with you. So you can obviously unclip it and take it with you when you're leaving the uh, scooter. The price of this was 75 euros. So you make of that of what you will, make of that of what you will. Um, I think anything with the Yamaha logo on uh, their items, you're going to pay a premium for anyway. But uh, yeah, it seems okay. We're going to fit it and see how it looks further on. There's just one other thing I'd like to mention uh, is with regard to the Tricity 300 recall, there are letters now going out to uh, Yamaha Tricity owners for the 300 with regard to the stand assist. Now there was a problem uh, with the stand assist which uh, apparently was not releasing correctly uh, and Yamaha did a recall uh, but they couldn't find a solution to that problem. But anyway, apparently they have now so they have found this uh, solution and they're doing another recall. So it's important now if you do receive this letter that you read the contents and make an appointment with your Yamaha dealer and they will then uh, put the new parts on to correct the problem. This is a good safety thing. Anything that's part of the safety 
can't be a bad thing. So one of the things while uh, we're at the Yamaha dealership uh, making appointments uh, for the recall is that I did notice there was a Kimco uh, CV3 and a brand new um, Yamaha Tricity 300. Uh, what I did is uh, I did a little bit of a walk round of them both uh, and uh, one thing that did surprise me was that the wheel size on the uh, Kimco CV3 was uh, a lot smaller uh, than the Yamaha Tricity. So what I'll do is that uh, I'll leave the walk round at the end of the video so you can have a look and uh, maybe it'd be nice to tell me what you think. Okay.